When the White House scheduled five television interviews with all the major networks, it was intended to push forward the economic stimulus bill. It didn't quite work out that way. Mr. President, has this been an embarrassing day for the administration? Well, I think it has. Oh, it made me angry and, and uh, disappointed, and I think I messed up. I screwed up. The withdrawals of both Senator Tom Daschle and Nancy Killifer dominated and are likely to be more than a one-day distraction. Morning, everybody. As the day unfolded, questions were raised about the administration's overall approach. At the daily press briefing, the thoroughness of their vetting process for nominees came up again and again. The president's confident in uh, the people he's chosen to serve in government. Again, the president has confidence in the system. Do you uh, acknowledge that there is a breakdown in the vetting uh, process? The, the president is confident in the process. And while the Obama team was focused on Mr. Daschle and Ms. Killifer, Republicans on Capitol Hill raised more and more questions about the contents of the stimulus bill. Someone needs to explain to me how giving tens of millions of dollars to the National Endowment of the Arts or the Smithsonian Museums will reverse the, quote, devastating effects of the economic crisis. And it led to tough questions when President Obama sat down with the anchors. So is it getting pecked to death? Uh, you are taking hits right now from, from all sides. So what happened? The administration limited each interview to only 10 minutes, which didn't allow much time for follow-up questions. And so President Obama was able to stay on message in defending his bill. Uh, and this hasn't been talked about enough. Of all the things that uh, some opponents of the package have talked about, when you tally all those up, amount to less than 1%, less than 1%, less than 1% of the overall package. Still, it was one of the toughest days so far for the president at a time when he can ill afford distractions. Well, this is the problem when you make these self-inflicted wounds. You end up uh, being distracted from really the people's business.